Where do you think, just as a hunch, this one ends up? Well, I think this guy is an absolute... Can I say knob-end on television? Yeah, of course. This guy is an absolute knob-end. <laughs> There's something about him I find just enormously annoying. He's like some throwback from the goddamn Don't 60s. Don't say that. He's a nice man. He's not a nice man. It's ridiculous. Like, seriously, go to Syria, go to Iraq, go to... You know, go to Afghanistan and explain your little stupid inner city dinner party conversation to them. <laughs> Say, oh, yes, well, I've been thinking about it. And now they realise that while well, there is an implied freedom of political expression in the Constitution, it doesn't seem to be recognised by the Electoral Act. I think perhaps I should have the right not to let it roll on. I'm going to get the whole bloody court moved to Adelaide so they can hear me talk about it. <laughs> get stuff! He says he's been <laughs> to, you know, eight different countries and only two of them have forced him to vote. Go back to them! <laughs> go back to them! Sod the hell off! Rock up, get off your fat ass, go down to the polling booth, do your stupid donkey vote, draw a picture of a penis if you have to. Fine. You don't have the right not to be governed, you don't have the right not to obey the law, and you don't have the right not to vote in this country. Well done, sir. Thank you very much. Well done. Written, well spoken seen. and authorised by Joe Hildebrand. He'll retweet you if you say <laughs> nice things about him on Twitter. Take a break. More as we are live across the country, only on Sky News.